Hey guys, Ninja 0 here. Today we're going to be doing how to be the ultimate prankster in Cakes Wars. Yes, I'm back. I had some audio issues. You can find out more about that on my Discord. Link in the description. The first step is to try and get on green team. If you don't get on it, it's okay. But just try and get on it. Just so you can mess up some rush team. Now, what you want to do is you want to throw out your sword just because that's funny. It doesn't have to actually be good, worth a while, but just because it's funny. You also want to only buy deploy platforms, never buy actual blocks. Again, just because it's funny. Again, this is going great. We are... That was... I didn't even know. Must be a new update. Um, so... Yeah, we are going to, again, only buy deploy platforms. We got another one. We are going to buy only deploy platforms. And you can see our team is very nice. I think that guy just walked off the edge. Oh, is this guy a builder? He might be a builder. We're going to see if he is. Maybe he'll help us. Now we're going to randomly just start mining some blocks just to prank them. They can never stop this. It's... It's non-defeatable, and we got a block. Let me throw that out. No blocks, guys. Again, only pranksters use deploy platforms. Unless, of course, they're praying with deploy platforms, which I'll get in a second. You also want to completely ignore chat. Pranksters don't write in chat. You can see how I'm clearing my chat, even though they're accusating uh, the guy who had the jump boost and was totally 100% legit. Now, this block pranked can't even stop me. I'm too insane. Now right now they're saying we should target yellow since that's what the team the hacker was on. We're not going to do that. Instead we're just going to keep going to green, which was the one team that I think ended up killing the hacker. Or not the hacker, the guy with the jump boost. The guy was not hacking, it was just some insane jump boost that he somehow got. We don't know how though. So you can also tell he's not hacking because he's a level 11. All hackers are less than le are le level 10 or below he's a level 11 guarantees he's not a hacker and again we're just going to break some blocks just to prank up not our teammate but any other team that comes for us this is the guaranteed strategy to win guys guarantees now to be a prankster you need to take off your leggings and chest plate so you just have helmet and boots on that is a guaranteed prank they won't even know what hit them it is so hilarious they can't stop. And you actually want to throw these off the edge just so it guarantees you can't throw them off the edge. You can't throw them off the edge. I thought you could. You cannot throw them off the edge, guys. So you do have to just... Now, we don't actually have a way to get back to our base, but you can see this guy is about to be pranked so hard. If you get, if someone kills you with arrows, that is the ultimate prank. They cannot stop him. They can't even stop arrows. It's so funny. You can tell this person is good, but they were no match for the arrows. They were no match for the arrows. Now we're going to try one last thing. We're going to switch to Builder. Um, builder is another. Um, but, and you'll notice when I actually were in chat, my text is gray. You want to change your level color to gray. No matter what level you are, you want it to be gray just to mess with people so they're like what he's a level 100 but he's gray I'm not actually level 100 I'm level 25 now we are going to prank some people hopefully we can actually get a little bit longer this round I think this is our third round um, I don't know now we're only going to wait for three blocks just because that's what you do now we have to actually wait for one of our teammates to start building and look at this this guy is going to start building so now we just want to try and get in the block with them. Now we're going to do a little bit of speed bridge, then randomly stop. And now we stop. We're not going, and now we're going to just build a wall. Just go up, straight up. And now we wait. Now we get the kill with with the deploy platform. See how ultra prankster this is? They can't even stop it. Can't even. 
you you can see how super effective it is. You can see by just punching, I've already first off increased archaic defense by way too much, as well as stopped them completely. Now we're not actually going to buy deploy platforms. Oh, look at this! Another person's coming. We are going to completely wreck them with our deploy platforms once again. Our entire goal is not to get kills; it is to prank. So you can see how we got that deploy platform kill. Again, there is our cake. It's completely open, but we're not going to... We need to defend that real quick, so we're just going to go like this. And we want to throw that sword off the edge. We don't need a sword. Because if you die by a wool block, you are completely destroyed. You can't come back from this. And now the classic... Deploy platform kill. They got killed by a knitted platform. They can never come back from that. Once you are killed by the knitted platform, you just want to, again, throw that sword right off the edge and get those knitted platforms ready. Deploy platforms. Depends if you're what you want to call it. And again, you don't have to use deploy platforms. You can use anything. You can kill them with snowballs. Again, don't throw them. Fletched arrows. And if you don't have that, if you're a warrior, you have to use your fists. I'm sorry. It's a shame. Or you can, of course buy something. I recommend wool, as it says was killed by uh, wool. And now I think we have a little bit of team griefing, so there's only one thing to do right now, is just randomly place this. Um, we don't want anyone destroying our defense on their, t or on their team again. We are all about not team griefing on this. So you have to, again, only wool. Now green is entirely targeting us, so we have to do the only thing reasonable. And that is just switch to our sword, get a crazy combo, kill a guy, and then use our fists. Now we need some knitted platform action. Because knitted platforms actually place blocks when you punch it, it does make sense what I'm doing. It's not just just to be a troll to my team. I'm actually doing helpful stuff, if you guys didn't realize. You can see I'm actually suffocate trapping people. Um, now, so, it's all good. And for some reason, that's like that. Don't know why. We got another guy in here. Um, now, they're farming kills at this point, so we do have to switch to the sword because we want to help our team out. So there's only one thing really to do. Oh, they were waiting for their teammate. That makes more sense. Again, kills with deploy platforms. Now you want to do the only thing reasonable, which is run. Just run right into a different team's base. And go for their cake. Um, you don't have to do anything else. You just have to do this. And again, get those deploy platforms ready because you're going to do the only thing reasonable, which is place them. Doesn't even have to be... There we go. I like how this guy chased me the whole way. The whole way. That's just funny. And this is going to be our last round. Hopefully we can get some good actual pranks. We won't have a rush team. Um, this is a nice map to do a couple different ones, but I don't know if we're actually going to get them in-game. Hopefully we will. Um, again, sword, not needed. Take off this. Helmet and boots only. Now, the problem with helmet and boots only is unless you have runes of holding, it doesn't actually save your inventory, so you do have to do it every time, which is why it's not the most effective method ever. Time to be a prankster. Alright, this guy just said he'll defend, and considering he's a level 4, he's not actually on my team, um, but he can defend my kick for me. I'm gonna let him, just kidding, I'm gonna go prank him. I'm gonna use my deploy platforms just to get here quickly. Again, we are going for a real game this time. I'm not joking, we're gonna go for real trolls. Real good pranks. Let's get our sword off. I can't throw out that. Okay, we have a nice red team coming, and again, only reasonable thing to do is the classic deploy platform trap, which everyone knows about at this point. It's 100% effective, and you can see they definitely did not dodge it. Let's go again with the exact same trap. They will never see that coming. Can't even stop it. Now, it looks like they tried to do it to me, but I have effectively stopped them. Deploy platform kills are all that matters to me. Thank you. And you just have to say thank you. 
if you're wondering what that GUI was, that's Pot Crash. It's uh, it's just nice things like FPS boost. Definitely recommend it. Again, they cannot stop deploy platform kills. It is too effective. I almost I almost deployed drop that guy. That could have been bad. Let's go. Now you can see they're getting obsidian, which means there's only one thing to do. I mean end stone, they're not getting obsidian. We're gonna go capture that other beacon and we're gonna go get obsidian. Not for us, for them. We're going to place obsidian in front of their base. Just randomly, not even not even just like a wall. Just like two pieces of obsidian. Up and down. Um, now there will be a gap. The ground block won't be obsidian. And I know it might seem a little bit weird why I'm doing that, but it will make sense in a second. It's just actually to save obsidian. Um, my ultimate goal would should just be build the three by three of obsidian, uh, just because then they have to actually climb up over that every time they want to do something, or they could eventually break it. Of course, that is rather expensive, so it will take a couple tries and a couple different runs just to get it. Now we're going to just AFK on the forge until we get this obsidian. It shouldn't take too long as we are about we lost a beacon. Okay. Alright, um, we're going to take that sword out of our hand. We're just going to wait. Um, it's getting a little bit long, but we're about to get our first piece of obsidian. I think that's pretty much good enough for now. Once I'll go capture that beacon, and then you guys can see the ultimate prank. They cannot come back from this, guys. Every prank guarantees that they lose. I swear, this works 100% of the time. You also want to throw your blocks onto the ground just so that way it's messy. Again, ultra prank. Now it's on your team, so be a little bit careful with that one. Um, but, I mean, messy floor. No one can come back from a messy floor. Now, you can see someone's actually at Red's base, and it's red. Now, you have to stop them. This is the ultra stop right now. They cannot come back from this. Stopped. They cannot come back from this. It guarantees that they lose. Again, a kill. Super guarantees. Works 100% of the time. Look at that. Wait, that's not their base. They cannot... They cannot come back from that one piece of obby. It's just going to be there forever. They're not going to bother... Oh, we lost our beacons. I'm not going to be able to get an obby if we lose our beacons. Now, it looks like they're building the sky base, so the only possible probable thing to do... Now, this is actually a real prank. This will, like, me completely mess up someone's day. So see how they do the steps. If we put a piece of obsidian on the steps, it ruins their whole staircase. Now, it might seem like it com like it's completely stupid, but it does, when you think about it, ruin their whole staircase. <laughs> so, that one's an actual prank, as long as well as the other ones I've been doing. Um, you know, we're going to go to them, and we're going to try and get that going on again. Completely throw out all your bricks. Look how messy that is. My god, they can never, your team cannot. Now, it's a team grief, so be careful with it. Um, team griefing is a bannable offense, but... Throwing bricks, you can see he has to clean it up. I feel bad for that guy. I'm, I'm sorry. Well, at least he gets to keep the bricks, right? Again, ultra prank right there. Now, we got our team coming. That's actually our team. Now, this guy's coming for us. There's only one thing to do. One thing to do. We need to just place it down. He can't even come back from that piece of obsidian. Now, our whole team is chasing this guy, but we're not going to. We're just going to sit on the forge and try and get some more obsidian again making just some random pieces of obsidian really they're just like why they can't even come back from it it is literally insane now we have enough for another piece of obsidian and again we're going to prank our team i'm sorry team by throwing down all our bricks you can throw it down all at once which is a little bit nicer or you can do it separately which is not as nice but it's e kind of easier for you and now it's time to prank this guy ready can't even stop it. Now this guy's trying to prank me, so we have to do the only thing possible, which is prank him. Someone's here. Time for a deploy platform kill. Again, you can't come back from a deploy platform kill. I think this guy's hacking. <laughs> no. No. 
Now it looks like red's putting in obsidian, so the only thing to do, of course, we don't know. They can never come back from this, our team. See, our, our teammate's nice by cleaning it up. Someone's eating our cake. Oh, we lost. Okay, well, that's, that's it for the video. Um, sorry about being gone again. That was, like, audio. No idea what's wrong with it. It should be all fixed now. Hopefully it's working. If it's better, leave a comment. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Um, it really helps out. Um, if you have any questions about anything, if you need more tips, um, if you want, like, a rundown of everything I explain in the video, because uh, just so you can copy and paste it, just so you can send it to your friends um, of course recommend definitely sharing it with your friends um, then you can of course ask for that in the comments and I can give you one of those um, that's it again the IP for this I, I'm playing on the US Mineplex uh, us.mineplex.com if you want to play because you're European uh, eu.mineplex.com all that will be in the description below um, please leave a like if you thought this video was extremely helpful as I know everyone thinks how am I going to prank him? Now you have ways to prank. Um, of course, works 100% of the time. Guarantees that they are trolled. That's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in another video. Bye.